Hello everyone, this is Chris, Seven Seas Marine. Today I'm doing a video on a beautiful 2002 Stingray 220DS powered by a 5.0 270 horse Volvo with the SX drive, only 207 hours. As you can see, boat is lift, lift kept. There is bottom paint, for which uh, the owner had in a uh, water storage for a few years of its, of its life, but uh, in 2000, what, 10 was Five. it? 2005, uh, lift was installed and it's been out of the water since. Uh, coming around, it's gonna be hard for me to get the, the uh, starboard side, but on the port side, I'm gonna show you how clean this is. Try to get a close up of the gel coat. Owner kept it in immaculate shape. Again, this is a 220DS, it's a 2002, only 207 hours. You can see the um, floating uh, dock and lift that he has here, which is also for sale separately if anybody has interest. Beautiful windshield. When I get through to the out, the inside, we'll go through the whole interior of the boat. Just from over here, just to give you a quick shot, just to show you how clean the vinyl is. And it does have a matching blue bimini top. The boat is named John Lee. Coming around here, coming around the port side off the stern. There's your SX Drive Volvo Penta. Another shot of the actual boat lift and dock. There's a swim platform with a, um, a swim ladder. I'm gonna walk down this main ladder here. Thank you. I'm gonna walk down this main ladder here and hop in so I can show you guys the interior. Again, I just wanna point out how nice and clean this guy's kept this boat. Yeah, I'm gonna go back. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm trying to show them the boat. Okay. Sorry about that. Now I'm standing on that lift, that dock lift actually right now. So I can show you guys what that looks like as well. There's a button that slides them wheels out and it drops you right to the, into the water. Here's your SX drive, uh, Volvo Penta again. This does have a Volvo Penta 5.0 GSX GXI 270 horse once again. Looks like he has two rocket launchers off the stern. For, for those who do fish, rear stern light, uh, tie on for a uh, uh, raft or a, a, a water scare. Uh, stern rail, all in perfect shape. I'm standing on the extended platform right now. As you can see, it looks like it's a good two and a half foot. So you got plenty of room back here to stand. Looking in, I can see that this boat is rated for 11 people or 1,500 pounds. Perfect kind of all-around boat. You can ski, you can fish, luxury. It's got plenty of seating, plenty of storage under the seats. I'm going to go through that in a minute. And we'll go through the walkthrough here. Boat does have snap-in carpets, but we wanted to show you how clean the uh, fiberglass is. Absolutely no soft spots that I see or feel. I'm going to walk through here boat table let me go through each part here I just want to give you a relative idea uh, this will be your engine compartment here um, let me lift this up does this just lift up or does yeah, this just pull it yeah no, no, pull, but towards you taking it back yep I got it all right there's your 5.0 GSXI Volvo 270 horse 207 hours as you know for 2002 it's very very low hours guy uh, has had it maintained locally um, we can uh, provide any type of information anybody needs to know on the motor uh, your cushions your uh, your back cushions are in perfect condition as well as all your seat cushions there's plenty of storage underneath of these as well off the port side let me walk through here just to give you an idea That's looks it looks like you have your uh, your access plate panel to all your, it looks like there's a uh, uh, water, uh, let me see. Yeah, it's for automatic. Yeah, but there's an automatic water pump here for the shower, yeah. Um, plenty of access, as you can see. So that's where he stores his, this boat does come with a custom blue canvas to match the blue bimini, which I think I showed you from the outside, but there it is, beautiful shape. Everything's put away nice and neat. As you can see, the boat is very, very, very clean. Guy keeps very good care of it. Uh, more, more access for storing boat uh, nets, or I think he's probably got buoys in there or whatnot. Uh, 
That does. Okay, so so the buoys, he does have life jackets and buoys that also come with this uh, vessel upon, upon uh, purchase. Cup holders, there's three on your port side. Sink, more storage area where he keeps his ski, looks like ropes and stuff like that. Oh, is that a? Uh, I can't see the bottom. So this does have a drain. Yes. Is it? It's not a live well, though, right? Uh, you could. I mean, but does it have a lot? Does it have like? You, no. Oh, okay. No. Yeah, you could add a live well pump to this and turn this into a live well if you're a fisherman. But it does work as a cooler slash drained well, compartment. Yeah, I'm gonna get to that. Yep. Yeah. Little glove compartment where he keeps his flares and horn and whatnot, all your essentials for your boating safety. Uh, there's your sink, hot and cold water, right? Does that have all hot? No hot. No hot. All right, all cold. So you do have a nice little sink you can wash off. It does come with the specifically designed Igloo Marine 25 gallon, I think it's 25 gallon cooler there, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and uh, that that include that comes included with the boat. There's an area here where your uh, fire extinguisher is that's desi designed to snap right in. This is your walk through your windshield towards the bow side of the boat. Just to show you guys, it's all glass. There's no cracks. There's no scratches it's all in very very good shape more snaps actually this windshield uh holds lower snaps which holds the the the, the stern to mid section of the boat's cover on which is nice because you get that coverage all all winter or, or when it's raining uh coming through here uh, port side uh cup holder as well you have a a, a, la a port side lounge with a very nice vinyl again all the vinyl on this boat is in great shape just to give you a little more show, show you a little more storage there's the the uh, the the life jacket holder that holds four that also comes with the vessel uh you have a marine speaker here i don't know yes and we also had one back there on the lower port side there's two there. there's two two on each side probably i would imagine uh which will give you a four speaker system we'll get around to that in a second every seat comes off of this boat and everything is in beautiful shape as you can see Plenty, plenty storage and storage and access. What's neat about this boat, it's kind of set up. I guess this is almost like a deck boat, right? Oh, it is called. Yeah, yeah, because um, what's what's neat is you have this up. You have this uh, area off the front where where there's almost a step up with two more uh, cup holders, more storage, and then up front in a separate area you'll have two. Looks like twin. Uh, are they spotlights or are they just your your? Uh, so your do oh, yeah, these are the docking lights that in the ad you guys will we can refer to. Um, you know, while you're docking, you can keep them on and uh, just an extra added thing. As you can see how far the snap-on cover comes. All these snaps are up to the very, very front of the boat. I'm assuming this is probably about uh, anchor storage. That is correct. Uh, does the anchor and the line come with it? Or you take yes. yeah. Oh, yeah, anchor and lines come with it. Again, beautiful, beautiful shape. Beautiful boat. What's nice about these deck boats is the, uh, the stability on these things. Uh, they're deep. They're 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 not they're not they're high. The, their gunnels are higher than a uh, than a bow rider. Really really safe and comfortable. Uh, stainless cleating on both sides, and your stainless bow rail um, in perfect shape. No breaks. No dents. Dings. Nothing. Really nice shape. Coming around the starboard side. There's two mat. There's the matching lounge as on the port side. Same thing, same same sort of storage inside. Uh, starboard bow rail as well, in perfect shape. There's your Garmin antenna, just coming from this view here, just to show you from the front to the back. Let me step back and actually stand on the highest point. It does have a boat table, as you've seen. I've been going in and out of it, and I'm assuming that's probably a ski locker down low, right? Yes. Yeah. Um, great boat, guys. Just per perfect shape. Uh, let me just show you real quick while I'm walking through here. There's your ski locker. You can keep, obviously, if you're not going to ski, you can keep any equipment you need in there. There's tons of act, tons of room in this boat. It's got a ton of storage. Uh, show you the head. It's got a porta potty here, all in beautiful shape. It has a breather window, so you can get out of the sun, get some air. Um, this porta potty has to be dumped, right? Or does, yeah. or does this have a waste? Uh, can you pump this out or no? No, you take. I, you, you I, dump it. Yeah, right. it's a it's a porta potty. Yeah, it's not it's not a vacuum flush, but it is a porta potty, and it's perfect for for women to get out of the sun and use the, use the bathroom and not have to worry about it. Comes with a Ritchie compass. I'm going into the cockpit of the boat here now. 
uh, let me sit down here just to show you what we have. We got temperature gauges, RPMs, oil, fuel gauges, all your switches, your typical blower. I'm assuming they're probably accessory and docking light switches, water pressure switches. Does come with a unit in Oceanus uh, ship to shore radio. And there's your Shakespeare antenna right there. So you can just get. Comes up and pushes in. Okay. There's your Kenwood KDC 316S. KDC 316S. It's a CD changer. Um, that is powered by four speakers, as I showed earlier. Nice stereo system. Uh, there's all your, your uh, switches for your... Win uh, does this have windshield wipers? No. Okay, no. Um, uh, cockpit lights. Looks like water pressure lights, docking lights, horn. Um here is your stingray steering also coming with this boat is a garmin gps the model number is a garmin gps map 182 and a hummingbird fish finder the model number is a 300 tx super clean again everything on this boat is super clean another cup holder plenty of room there there's your volvo penta um, uh, gear shifter and your trim you got a uh, throttle trim uh, trim gate uh, trim um, switch uh, is there a trim gauge on this? Yes. Yes. Okay. All the way back here by the hummingbird, you also have a trim gauge, as you can see. Fuel, oil, miles per hour, RPMs, temperatures. Uh, just to show you the other portion of the uh, glass windshield, it's all in beautiful shape. Another shot of the rear bimini. Uh, what's nice is it does have a captain's chair with a bolster. This this piece probably slides back and forth, I would assume. Comes up. Yeah, comes up and goes and goes even with the bed. Yeah. That's it. Uh, looks like it has some sort of an adjustment underneath. What is that? Up or down. Up or down. Right, can give you a little more height or, or, or uh, lower. I, get, I would assume that boat table can also plug in there. Yes. So you can move it from side to side. Yeah. So this way you can have a rear um, a rear table if you guys prefer to eat your lunches out outside in the in the rear of the boat. Uh, again, it is rated for 11 or 1,560 pounds. There's another floor board here. This is where you have your battery. Is there a, a battery switch in here? Yes. Okay. Is it in that door? Batteries for one or two. Gotcha. Or both. So it's got a, a dual battery switch. Probably a Perco switch, right? Right. Perco one. There's there's your uh, second. Uh, I think that's a second battery in it. Yeah, two batteries, right? Two Decamarine batteries, boat's ready to roll. Uh, rear stainless cleaning. There is your, your, your fill for your water and your shower. There is your gas fill. Aside from that, I think we pretty much went over the most of the boat. Anything else that I missed here? No. Again, guys, this is Chris, Seven Seas Marine. My cell phone number is 609-668-0169. You can contact me any point of the day. My, uh, my, uh, a boat brokerage store is over at All Seasons Marina on 34th Street Bridge. Feel free to give me a call in regards to this boat. You'll definitely, definitely love this boat. Thank you.